be the best host, I always love putting out amazing cheese boards. So quality is key. You must shop for the best cheeses. First, I pick out my cheeses and I put down a nice piece of parchment paper. I'm gonna remove my cheeses an hour before I plate them up for the best flavor and the best aroma. And I lay them out from mild to strong. First cheese that I always put out is a brie, which everyone loves. It's creamy and it's light. Then I'm gonna put out my camembert. This is a French cheese from Normandy. It goes really well over a baguette and just as is, it's delicious. I put out the Emmental next, which is produced in the Rhone Alps. It's got a really light, nutty flavor. Raclette is produced in the Savoie region. It is earthy and creamy. Mimolette will bring brightness and color. It's a sharp cheese that I love. It's very different from the rest of the cheeses. It's got an edge to it. Comté is a cheese that's a little bit sweet. It's been produced in the Jura Mountains, and it's actually my favorite cheese. It goes really well with apricots and figs, and you can just put them straight over crackers or French bread, and it's heaven. From d'Ambert is a PDO cheese, which means it's protected designation of origin. So it's a really unique cheese to the region. There's something about From d'Ambert that I cannot explain. It's more of an, almost like an umami flavor. Then I laid out some fresh fruit. Pears and apples, I always say, are the best. They go really well with any cheese board. And then I love adding some nuts to the board. I slice some French bread, and I just add that on the side and I'm head over heels with pairing wines, sparklings, champagne, you name it. You really want to make your cheese board an artistic centerpiece. It makes all the difference in the world. It's there to create memories. Take any dish from good to great to magnifique with fromage. Watch recipe videos from top chefs at cheesesofeurope.com.